Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Season 6, Episode 6 of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. called Inescapable. So we start off with Fitzsimmons wake up in a room and then um, they hug and embrace a little bit and then Altara brace them of what they'll be doing and basically they're going to be help solving the time travel thing and Basically, they're in a mind prison where they can summon up all the tools with their mind. <clears throat> then uh, she dis then she leaves, and then we have Fitz proposes to Simmons. She says yes, <laughs> and then they talk. And um, at first, they're talking about like trying to find each other, and then when he starts talking about the future and stuff all like that, she flips out, and uh, she turns into a little. Uh, her little girl self and runs away. Fitz follows her and is to her bedroom and talks to her. And she wants him to read her a story. And at first it's Ellen, Fitz, and Enoch trying to find them. And then it turns into that uh, spell book from season five and then season four. Yeah, season four with the whole book thing. And uh, then he's like, no, no, that's a bad book. <laughs> And then um, they also see a uh, music box, and she said, that's where I put all my bad memories and stuff in there. And then we cut to where they're back in the room, and uh, they start to bicker a little bit, and then Atari comes back in the room and tells them to focus, and then we go back to um, the outside of their mind, and you know, Enoch is worried, and Atara doesn't care. She's like, I don't care. They need to get going. And then we have Fitzsimmons argue. And so he's just like, how about I just create another Ada? She can help me. I need an LMD. And so she goes back to her grown-up self. Simmons does. And fusses him out about that. And then uh, Fitz keeps pressuring her about stuff. And they finally... Um, she finally kind of breaks down and uh, memory kind of folds and has Mac in it. And it's basically, um, you know, it's the memory of him being gone and they're trying to figure out what they're going to do as far as service and stuff like that. Then Fitz starts to spin a little bit. And then the Mary part came up and that just made it worse. And then the Coulson thing also made it worse because of the whole, like, you know, why, why isn't he laying down? Why isn't he resting? And all this stuff. And that got a little much for him. And <clears throat> then we cut to a memory. Uh, so when she's going to this memory through the bunker, she's starting to hear a sound of just people walk, of some, of someone walking. And then she, uh, then we go into the memory where they first met, and um, it was super awkward. And then uh, this kind of reels back in, and then he starts to spin again. And then Simmons knows what's coming, and it's bad fits that's coming. That's the whole, um, you know, the whole sound of the walking is bad fits. And so they try to run for it, but they come across them with um, Hydra, and they shoot at him. And then they go, so, <clears throat> then they go back to her childhood uh, room where they were in the first time, where, like I said earlier, and the box is starting to shake and move, and then it opens and you hear a song, and then a song. Gary Simmons attacks them and so they hide in the closet and then they're in the bunker and then they go to a shield memory with Coulson and it's when they first got recruited. And then we have Scary Simmons attacks Fitz and then Sim uh, Simmons ran into bad Fitz because he made the whole Simmons help you know help me like ploy and that worked. And so, um, he ties her up and is going to put her into that memory machine that causes a lot of pain. And she mocks him. And then we have Scary Simmons hurts Fitz. And it's literally crazy. 
And then we have Atara is back on the outside and again she doesn't care about what's happening. She just wants them to fix everything. And Enoch is still worried. And then we have uh, Bad Fits and Scary Sims torture um, the other person. So uh, Bad Fits turn on the machine and that of course hurts Simmons and then Scary Simmons uh, tortured fits by removing his heart yeah <laughs> and so then they started to piece together it's like okay we're in our own mind so let's get our friends to help and so um quake comes in and blasts all the hydra people and um and knocks out bad fits and then matt comes in with the um shotgun um axe shotgun and tries to key a uh Gary Simmons, and then she attacks Mac, and, you know, they both quake, and Mac tells them to run for it, and so they do, and they get stuck in a, uh, the first we have a really cool fight scene with, um, with Quake, and that was pretty cool, and then, uh, they run into each other into the containment room, where, uh, Fitzsimmons argue so bad, <laughs> like, really bad, they really bring up everything that's happening and then we have um bad simmons and uh well scary simmons and bad fits like circling them like sharks and then they go and talk about the water thing how like everyone they rescue each other and they keep doing it and then all of a sudden they bring up the ocean thing so water starts pouring in and then then they yell i love you after they keep fighting and yelling and then you know, they, then the water stops, and then they kind of make up, and then when they get out of the containment field to go fight uh, Scary Simmons and Bad Fitz, they walk out and see that both of them are making out. <laughs> so Scary Simmons and Bad Fitz are making out, and they start to do other things that they were like, okay, I didn't know you liked that. <laughs> and stuff like that. I was like, oh my god. And then they go back to the room, and then they make up officially, and then Atara comes in. It's like, that was the biggest waste of 5 minutes and 23 seconds I've ever seen. <laughs> and then, um, then all of a sudden, like, her, she gets taken down. And so they wake up out of this, uh, mom prison, and Enoch... KO'd everybody and took, I guess, took everyone offline and saved them. And then they escape. And as they're escaping, Simmons says, Oh, yeah, you're also a grandfather. Just let you know. He's like, What the bloody hell? <laughs> and then we, uh, and then they escape. We don't know where yet. And then we cut to where Daisy and Mac talk about um, the people that caused the destruction of. Enoch's planet are here on Earth. And that was in the episode. Uh, I really, really enjoyed this episode. We get a lot of things happening in here. And at first, like, they're all happy to see each other. Then we get to see the arguments start to pick up and how Simmons is reluctant to share stuff and then just kind of spills out. And then, you know, they had to battle their demons literally, but with each other. <laughs> demons and I thought it was a really good centric episode um about them and how they're trying to work everything out and so I literally give this a plus I thought it was a really fantastic episode and basically it's like a whole thing centered around Fitzsimmons which really doesn't happen a whole lot like there's the underlying layer of it but it's not like you know they get their own Stitcher episode. The really thing that only really happened was like literally last season. It was they had they came more to the forefront than they did in the previous seasons. So I really really enjoyed it, and I like the progression of everything. And I'm always Team Fitzsimmons, so I call him Fizai. <laughs> so anyway, um, really good episode. I really enjoyed it, and. That's what I'm doing for this video. So, if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, do you agree, disagree. And don't forget to subscribe, it helps out the channel a lot. And I'll be posting Jessica Jones 
tomorrow and I'll be doing um, entire 13 days of that so that's gonna be coming up soon well literally tomorrow so anyway uh, get ready for that. I only seen the first episode, but I'm planning to binge watch the mess out of it tomorrow. So anyway, I'll see y'all later. Bye, everybody.